Well, hello. I got nothing. <laughs> See, this is the problem with greetings. Like, there's not much that you can follow. You know? It's like you got a mediocre intro. How are you going to have a good body? You know? I'm good with conclusions. I'm excellent with conclusions. Like, I love ending shit. Ending shit is my favorite part of everything. Unless it's a really good song. Speaking of really good songs, I feel like I should talk about this album. But I can't listen to it because I'm afraid that uh, the copyright boys will get on to me. But, uh, I'm going to see them in a couple of weeks. Exactly one week from tonight. I'm going to see LCD, and I'm really fucking stoked about it, and I'm also scared because um, I really want to meet them, and I'm afraid that I won't be able to, or I'm afraid that they'll hate me, or um, they won't give a fuck about me. That's, that's really my main concern. Like, what if they just don't care if I live or die? What if I don't really resonate with them? Because I'm sure, you know, they talk to fans all the goddamn time. But, like, I'm not, like, Kathy Bates in misery or anything. I don't want, like, to intimidate people with my, like, like, uh, fan, fan stuff. You know, like, cause I, I know how, how people get, like, when they're into a musician or even just like an actor or something, it's like people just get so obsessive and they just think that they're so like otherworldly and they're really not. They're just a person that like, you know, eats and shits and jerks off. Like, <laughs> like I think about this shit all the time, y'all. But, like, people just get so obsessed with somebody, and they forget they're just a human being, you know? But they're an artist. That, that's really the difference. But typically, people are artists because of something that's, like, a lot worse going on in their head. I feel like the only reason that I do... Anything artistic that I do is because, I know I've said this before, I'll say it again, you know, I say that my comedy and my art, like it comes from a dark place, like that's really putting it lightly, um, get it, because it's a dark place, dude, he had like the wrong tricks to go on. <laughs> I don't think he realized that. Okay, never mind. He turned it off. This guy had his turn signal on for for the right blinker, but he just turned left. Because he's a moron. Maybe he just doesn't know the difference. A lot of people don't know the difference. I mean, when I tell people to go right, I usually point left. It's funny. It's really fucking funny. Um, hilarious, you guys. Just the everyday, the everyday comedy. <laughs> it's overwhelming. <laughs> But yeah, people just get obsessed though. <laughs> See, the thing is, I guess because I'm an artist myself, and I know that what I do is pretty authentic and pretty punk, and that's that's why I'm why I really want to be friends with LCD Sound System because I feel like they really respect the way that I do my comedy. If they're as punk as they say they are. <laughs> but.
had kind of had misgivings about them getting back together. But I knew that, that was going to happen because it was like blatantly obvious, especially watching that documentary. I was like, there's no fucking way he's done. <laughs> he thinks he's done. Like, he wants to be done. But if you're an artist, like, you're never done creating. It, you just keep going. You, you just do it in different ways. But he was right, though, to bring it back because, like, this is like a terrible time for fucking music. It's a terrible time for fucking everything, though, man. Except TV. <laughs> like, TV is amazing. Because everything else is so shit. You know? God, this is such a depressing-ass day, y'all. You have no idea... how depressed these clouds are. Like, they just look so fucking sad. It's just incredibly overcast right now. To the point that it really brings out my depression. <laughs> oh, but you're laughing now. You're having a good time. Yeah. eating a bunch of energy crumbs. You just see that? <laughs> I gave you some vortex. Eat up. Get that fucking energy. They're like these like breakfast snack things. But they give you like sustained energy is what it says. Courtesy of Monsanto. I probably shouldn't eat grain for that very reason, but I don't know how to avoid it. <laughs> that church billboard just says deacons. Remember that other billboard that was on that, that same church? It's like a Baptist church, another Baptist church. Imagine that in the cell, in the buckle of the goddamn Bible Belt. Um, God damn it. See, this is what happens, y'all. I, I carry around these, like, uh, items, these, these food items, and uh, I'll leave them in my purse. That's why they, they get all fucked up and break apart into, like, tiny pieces. And I don't want to waste the food because it's still food, you know? So I just put it in a cup, and then I, I eat it that way. <laughs> and, uh, anyway, what was I saying? I have no idea, man. There's Elena walking to work. That's hilarious. I live with four people. I, I, I don't live with four people. There are, I, I live with about 50 people inside my head. Um, a lot of stuffed animals. They don't require anything except love and attention, which I am more than willing to give. Um, but, yeah, uh, there are people that work here, uh, like four people that work here, they all live in the same fucking house. Like they're couples. I don't see how they can do that shit. They all live together, they work together. Mm -mm. Anyway, what, what were you saying? I have no idea. You were, you were talking about these crumbs. Baptist church. That one church billboard, it, it just cracked me up. It said effective Bible study. Like all the other ones, no good. But this one's effective because, you know, 
you put like LSD on the on the scripture, so <laughs> if you touch it. That would be really cool. That would, that's an effective Bible study. <laughs> Only if LSD is involved. Speaking of LSD, if anybody in the Vortex has that, you should learn how to make it. Yeah, I should. I don't like wasting food. I just think about all those children that are starving all over the world. And then, here I am just like wasting food just because it's like crumbs. See, look at that. <laughs> I'm not going to fucking waste it. Yeah. I really just want to play this album. What's the worst that could happen? I don't think they're gonna like kick you off the YouTube just because you do that. They might like take down the video or something. Will they really though? I don't think they give that much of a fuck. Dude, the first and last track on this album makes me cry so hard. That should always be like the best tracks, the first and last track. <laughs> Don't you guys love my opinions? They're so right. Did it. Ate all the fucking crumbs. No, I'm gonna have energy. I already drank like a whole cup of coffee too. Cause I'm fucking awesome. Yeah, I haven't smoked a cigarette in a week. It's crazy. I'm just putting up all kinds of videos. So now y'all have like no idea what the fuck is going on with me. I just feel like it's important. All of it. 